Well, thank you so much. Hello from Greece. Hello from Greece. What's your religion? I'm Muslim. Eid is soon, guys. Eid is literally probably the day after tomorrow. Do you like the name Vaishu or Vaishnavi? Um, both of them are so gorgeous. I don't know. I can't choose. I think Vaishu is like a cute, like, you, like if Vaishnavi is the person's name, then I think Vaishu is like kind of like a nickname. Do you like the name Manat? Yeah, Manat is such a pretty name. My name is partially made up. My real my my Arabic name would be Sabrine or Shafrin. Um well it's like derived from sabr, which means patience. Um which is funny because I'm literally not patient, I'm the most impatient person. Um but my dad like made it his own and he like named me Shabrine. What about Jill? What about Jill? Jill Goldberg? Oh, Jill Mama. Nice, Bruce. Obsessed with me. Dude, everyone needs a brown girl who's obsessed with them. <laughs> Laura, this girl's live keeps popping up on my 40 page. I can't escape it. I'm so sorry. <laughs> what are what is your opinions on Arabs? I love Arabs. I love your content. I watch your videos all the time. Thank you. Thank you so much, Ruhi. I love you. I've seen you around many times. Wait, where? Janaid, where are you from? I'm Canadian. But background, I'm Indian and Sri Lankan. Janaid is, I love the name Janaid. What will you do when you hit 500k? Um, merch will drop. Were you at Scatterbush a couple weeks ago? Uh, yeah. I did go to Scatterbush with my sister, like, I think a couple weeks ago. Sorry, guys, if you see me doing this with my eyes, it's because of my contacts. I see you in Markham Road. Girl, I have not been to Markham in a while. What inspired you to get into content creating? I've just always kind of been someone that was into like making videos and stuff of like anything. Like anything and everything. Like makeup videos, even like I just did. When I was younger, like when I was a teenager, or even like a child, I would always make videos like on my laptop and like on my phone and I would edit them on iMovie and I would post them on YouTube sometimes. And um, so yeah, I've always just liked that. Like, I don't know. It's just always been a thing for me. Kind of like, it, but it was never like something that I took seriously. It was just more so like a hobby. 
Now it's something that I obviously take seriously. Yes, I'm Elam Tamil. Get some eye mist for that, they work like a charm. I, I know, I've been on a lot of different eye drops. Um, I don't really, they don't really like work for me though. So I kind of just live with it. Why don't you answer your hair questions? I'm so sorry because I have a video coming out and I really want you guys to watch it. <laughs> because I like spend a lot of time just got my lipstick here. Um, I spent a lot of time making it, so I want you guys to wait for it. Celebrity crushes, guys, my celebrity crush crush is Dave Franco. I thought your hair was a wee for a while. My hair is, ex my, I do have clip and extensions in, but my natural hair is like this long. You, you can see like I have hair, it's not a weave though. favorite canadian dish um i don't know what like canadian dishes would be i guess like the only one that i can think of off the top of my head is um um poutine and i love poutine That video of you dancing is probs one of the cutest videos I've seen on TikTok. Oh, thank you so much. You're so gorgeous. Thank you, Shiv. Why did you date a Persian? Oh my gosh. You guys are funny. Indian food's on top, dude. I know. Asian, like, South Asian food, especially South Indian food, is like the best. That brown girl video is funny. Which one? I have a million brown girl videos at this point. I died to meet you, really? Oh my gosh, that's so sweet. Stop. Where do where where do you where are you from, Ruhi? But I'm gonna get pink soon and I'm really excited. I'm trying to be more like colorful this summer. I'm addicted to wearing black. <laughs> like I literally only wear black and I'm trying to get out of that. Um, so I've been wearing more like bright colors. Dude, guys, I cannot wait. I cannot wait to show you. I have a wedding coming up in May. The freaking sorry that I got. Oh my gosh. The color is to die for. The color is literally stunning. Like, the sari is stunning. And it wasn't even super expensive or anything, but it was such, like, beautifully, like, embroidered. Dude, I'm so excited to wear it and show you guys. And the top, like, I got it stitched in a certain way. Obviously, I still have to, um, see how it turns out because it's still being stitched. But I got it with like really short sleeves and it's just gonna look so good and it's gonna be like kind of low cut my mom was like don't be a whore don't be a whore during the wedding um oh yeah funny story so when i was getting my blouse stitched um like basically if you're not they see um whenever you get a sari um unless it's a pre pre-stitched i guess or whatever ready-made sari uh you 
have to stitch get the blouse stitched so you have to take the sari to um a seamstress and they will like make a blouse for you because like basically with saris what they do is they have certain like designated parts of the fabric that are for the blouse and they will like usually dictate it or on the um fabric 